we'll be cleaning the Nano ITC. So now your experiment is finished, we need to clean the ITC. So you first remove the burette handle and remove your syringe to be clean. Then we can use the cleaning tool that's provided with the instrument. This is a low volume instrument, so we have a low volume cleaning tool. You place this inside the instrument down into the cell and you have a connection that goes to your vacuum line and you have a connection that goes to your cleaning solution and here we're going to be rinsing through about a liter of water come over to my degassing station and hit the clean button and you can see that suction was created and now I'm flushing through liquid through my ITC cell now I'm just rinsing with water because I had water placed inside of my cell but if you have a sample that needs to be cleaned with detergent or maybe more harsh cleaning with sodium hydroxide or maybe a pepsin, uh, you can do that and just follow it up with a rinse of a large amount of water to make sure that you have your sample rinsed and cleaned for the next experiment. And then you could even follow up with a little bit of ethanol or methanol to make sure that the ITC cell is dry uh, before you load the next sample.